All righty. What do we have we here? Have our next guest. Uh, here is the Pat Metheny Group with their song, Have You Heard? Uh, Dave Sanborn introducing Pat Metheny. Oh, yes. Uh, let's see, who do we got here? Don't recognize the bass player. Classic sounding pet. Paul Wernico on drums? I guess I don't know who that is. It was about 1989, 1990. Very modern sounding. Serious sounding bongos there. to say that no one sounds like Pat Metheny except Pat Metheny. Which is good because if Pat Metheny didn't sound like Pat Metheny, who would sound like Pat Metheny? No. Oh. Very clean, very clean. Drums are killing. It is. I didn't know what he looked like, but I could tell by his symbol work. Paul Wernico. He was in the band before Dave Weckle. No, Dave Weckle was never in the band. So how do you like them apples? Thinking of Chick Corea. Never mind. Who's that percussion player? Nana Vasconuelos or something? Whatever her name is. This is some advanced music right here. isn't it? I believe so. This is an interesting lineup of musicians right here. The 
hopeless. Pat Metheny's got a very athletic stance when he plays. Looks like he's surfing. Excellent drumming. Ah, the vocalist is also playing the vibes. Wow, that was impressive. That seems like a different set than they usually had for night music. Bigger or something. Different location. Very good. Well, who's the vibes player? And who's the percussionist? I'll tell you, Paul Wertico doesn't get enough recognition for being as good as he is. He's an overlooked killer of the fusion jazz genre. Patrick Bruce Metheny. What was it? They're not listing a vibe player. Ah, interesting. Well, it's okay. Someone out there might know. Things remain a mystery. Maybe that was Steve Rodby on bass. He was very good. Whole band was killer. Yeah. Pat Metheny is one of a kind. Very nice. I saw Pat Metheny in 1979. So how do you like them apples? It was with the original Pat Metheny group. Mark Egan, Danny Gottlieb, Lyle Mays. Quite an interesting show. He had his guitar up on a stand. I had never seen that before. He played something that sounded like The Who Live at Leeds to me at one point. And I thought to myself, I wish this was The Who Live at Leeds. I did not appreciate him. Of course, I was 12 years old. So what are you going to do? All right. Thank you very much. Oh. And people were smoking pot up in the, uh, up in the, uh, what are they called? In the high uh, bleachers? No. The rafters? What? In the rafters. It was pot smoke in the rafters, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Thank you very much. <laughs> 